Red blood cells have a very important function for our body, to transport oxygen-rich blood throughout the body. Therefore, it is essential to keep them at healthy levels. What are red blood cells? Doctors call them erythrocytes and they are the most numerous cells in the blood. Their main component is hemoglobin and they obtain metabolic energy through lactic fermentation. In adults there are between 4,500,000 to 5,400,000 red blood cells. The deficiency in the number of erythrocytes is called anemia and the excess is polycythemia. Some interesting facts about blood. Red blood cells live approximately 100 or 120 days. After that time, the bone marrow produces another group of erythrocytes. Each molecule of hemoglobin has four iron atoms which bind to the oxygen molecules. Each erythrocyte is 33% hemoglobin. Normal values of hemoglobin are 14 grams, DL in women and 15.5 grams, DL in men. Red blood cells eliminate carbon dioxide. How to increase red blood cells? Some of the symptoms of anemia or a low erythrocytes are apathy and weakness. Lack of iron is the most common cause of a lower red blood cell count. To increase the amount, we recommend making some changes in your diet and your daily habits. 1. Eat iron. This will allow your body to rebuild and replace the lost nutrients. Iron increases red blood cells and also allows them to work better, since it is an essential component of hemoglobin. The foods richest in iron are Legumes, lentils, beans, vegetables, spinach, kale, nuts, plums and raisins, meat, liver, egg yolks. 2. Eat more copper. Adults need between 8 and 18 milligrams of this mineral every day. Women need more than men during the fertile stage, since they lose copper during menstruation. It is an essential nutrient for cells to access iron. The foods that contribute the most are nuts, beans, cherries, liver, poultry, chocolate. 3. Obtain more folic acid. Vitamin B9 helps in the normal production of red blood cells. If we do not have enough folic acid we can suffer from anemia. In addition, it plays an essential role in the functioning of DNA. Some 400 micrograms is recommended for women in the fertile stage and 600 micrograms when they are pregnant. Where to get folic acid? Whole grains. Leafy green vegetables, spinach, Swiss chard. Beans. Nuts. 4. Eat more vitamin A. Also called retinol, it is a very important compound for the development of red blood cell stem cells in the bone marrow. It guarantees the processing of hemoglobin by allowing the production of iron. Among the foods that contribute the most vitamin A are Carrots Zucchini Green leafy vegetable Sweet peppers Plum Grapefruit Watermelon 5. Increase the amount of vitamin C. This nutrient has many properties, such as strengthening the immune system and preventing viral diseases in winter. But vitamin C also stimulates the body's ability to absorb iron and, consequently, increases the number of red blood cells. Citrus fruits are the foods that contribute the most. 6. Incorporates vitamin B12. A good amount of this nutrient favors the production of erythrocytes in the bone marrow and increases their presence in the blood. In order to provide the body with vitamin B12, we recommend you consume these foods. Veal Eggs Bluefish, salmon, sardine Dairy products, milk, yogurt and cheese, better if they are skimmed. Soy, in any presentation. Beer yeast Wheat germ Mushrooms 7. Exercise. A sedentary lifestyle has many negative effects on our health. Among them, increase obesity and circulatory problems, as well as increase fluid retention or produce muscle pain. But in addition to reducing the number of red blood cells, it does not allow the creation of new copies. Exercise is essential to have an iron health and avoid many diseases. Routines that include at least a few minutes of cardio, running, jogging, cycling, etc. are recommended because they favor general oxygenation of the body. 8. No smoking. It is one of the worst habits that people carry out, more taking into account that nicotine and other chemicals present in the cigarette reduce oxygen and do not allow adequate blood flow. Smoking squeezes blood vessels and hinders the work of red blood cells. 9. Do not drink alcohol. 
Another habit harmful to our health that has a negative impact on the erythrocyte count. Alcoholic beverages convert blood into a thicker, slower liquid with less oxygen that cannot be transported properly. In addition, alcohol produces immature red blood cells without sufficient hemoglobin. 10. Perform physical exams. Go at least once a year to get complete blood tests. With a sample, it is possible to analyze the general conditions and the levels not only of red blood cells but also of cholesterol, iron, urea, creatinine, glucose, etc. It is very important to track data that is not within normal limits. The doctor will look at the blood test information and indicate what treatment or medication is needed. Natural health principles like using herbs, essential oils or consuming whole diets are the best ways to have healthy body and lifestyle. These essential healing herbs and their uses are beneficial. Here we are going to talk about healing herbs. When we talk about healing most people think it is something related to bad taste medicinal herbs but this time you are wrong. There are certain herbs that make your foods tastier, spicier and healthier at the same time. Herbs have used for their healing properties since so many years. Experts and scientists are finding more about the herbs that how beneficial they can be and according to them herbs can treat arthritis pain and inflammation, lowers cholesterol and blood sugar levels, regulates blood pressure and aids in many diseases. There are some herbs that even kills cancer cells and helps in curbing alcohol desires. But the problem is where to start? Especially when there are a lot of herbs and essential oil are present in the market. Anyways the problem is no longer a problem and we are here to help you out about the herbs and their problems following are the super healing herbs their benefits and uses top five healing herbs one cinnamon cinnamon is beneficial in lowering blood sugar levels as in study conducted in germany consuming cinnamon can reduce as the type 2 diabetes up to 10 percent it is also beneficial in regulating the cholesterol levels in the body by reducing the risks of heart diseases it reduces the cholesterol up to 13 percent as compared to the other medicines Cinnamon reduces weight, improves bowel movements, and prevents constipation. Uses To maximize its benefits, cinnamon powder can be used in capsules with water to treat cholesterol and diabetes problems. It can also be used as sprinkled over cereals, smoothies, or salads. Cinnamon tea can be made by steeping a piece of it in boiling water to lose excess weight. 2. Ginger Ginger is a great herb to cure many ailments including upset stomach, motion sickness and nausea that happens in pregnancy. Powerful antioxidant fights with free radicals. It also helps regulating the blood flow and let the body get fresh blood all over. Ginger is also beneficial in arthritis pain and inflammation caused by this. Ginger also helps in losing weight. Uses. Boil water and steep the ginger piece in it for 2 to 3 minutes and drink ginger tea with lemon drops for treating nausea, vomiting and dizziness. Ginger capsules are also available in 500 mg to 1000 mg. 3. Holy Basil Aids in relieving stress, anxiety, and reduces depression. Holy Basil tea is ideal for headaches and indigestion. It is beneficial in preventing in different types of cancers including breast cancer and tumors. Uses Basil leaves capsules are available in the market, which are used to relieve stress and anxiety. Drinking basil leaf tea will help in preventing breast cancer, just steep 10 to 12 fresh leaves in boiling water and drink after 5 minutes basil leaves are also used in different meals. 4. St. John's Wort St. John's Wort herb is ideal in soothing worries, which means it reduces depression and tension. This herb is known for promoting sound sleep and reduces insomnia. It boosts the happy chemicals in mind that enhances the mood. Uses St. John's Wort Herb Capsules are available in the market and it is recommended to take 300 mg capsule thrice a day to boost good mood and fight insomnia. Make sure to talk to your physician because it may react with other drugs. 5. Garlic Garlic lowers the risks of colorectal and ovarian cancer. Reduces tumor sizes. Promotes cardiovascular health while strengthening the organs. Regulates the blood pressure and reduces blood sugar level in the body. Garlic also clears the blockage in the arteries. Uses Use crushed garlics in meals and consume fresh garlic cloves early in the morning with water for several benefits.